Uh, thank you, uh, Vic. Uh, yes, as uh, Attorney Vic has just said, we have been, of course, following the count. At uh, ganun na nga, as of uh, this hour, 98 plus percent have already been counted at ang bilang ng boto ko ay nasa 31 million plus. Uh, kaya uh, maraming nagtatanong ngayon na kahit na hindi pa ako napuproklama, maraming nagtatanong, many people have been asking, what happens next? And what are we doing now? Well, right now, uh, syempre, uh, we have to, ay, ang intention ko is to hit the ground running uh, kung sakali man matuloy ang proklamasyon uh, in later this month ay kailangan nakahanda na tayo. So pinag-uusapan na namin ang mga appointment. As, I can, as I'm sure you can uh, imagine, uh, the economic managers are going to be uh, critical uh, for the next several years. Uh, because of the pandemic and the economic crisis. So that is something that we are um, looking at very carefully. But it's not only the economic managers, lahat talaga ng positions, uh, not only cabinet positions, but even other agencies ay tinitignan na namin lahat. Uh, uh, we, the, the process that we have established is that I am keeping uh, the organization, our Execom, who ran the campaign, uh, sila talaga yung mga advisor ko, so we are keeping the Execom going, the Executive Committee uh, going, and they will be, uh, syempre, the core group. But ang thinking ko uh, is that each department, uh, we have to talk to the specialists in that uh, discipline uh, or in that uh, sector. Uh, for example, if we're going to talk about agriculture, we have to talk to all the best agriculturists, all the best workers in, in agriculture that we know. Tanong natin, sino kayang pwedeng magaling? Uh, the same thing with uh, all the other departments. So, there is a core group and all the other departments are, are also, uh, will, will also have their, own, uh, have their own advisors that will advise the, uh, I suppose, the... the uh, the standing committee, uh, and of course myself. Uh, so that, 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 that is how the process has been, has been established. Kaya, actually, bago kayo dumating, we were in there uh, doing precisely that. I continue to be guided by, as I've said before, a uh, competence and a willingness to work uh, with uh, the next administration. Uh, uh, so we have removed, in our discussions, we remove immediately what their political leanings have been. Kung lumaban ba sa atin, kung sumama ba sa atin, that's not going to be part of the, uh, of the discussion. I'm also guided uh, by the critical areas that we talked about during the campaign. Uh, so yun ang mga inuuna natin. Of course, it's the economy, prices, it's... Uh, um, the price of energy, uh, lack of jobs, education, infrastructure, all of these areas that are going to be critical uh, in, in, in the next few years. So, ganun ang aming ginagawa and that has been the process, uh, that has been the process so far. I'm also guided by the fact that 31 million of our uh, kababayans have voted for unity. And I am guided by that in the sense that I will continue to, to, to work for a, uh, a government, that, uh, an administration that, uh, that, has, that gives voice to everyone who wants to help. Uh, we may not agree, we may not in the end do, uh, we, we, or we might do uh, exactly as they say, but whatever it is, uh, the, it is not important who the messenger is. The importance is going to be the message. Uh, the, uh, 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 in the next few days, I uh, will be talking to you. Maka every day, there will be some, something to announce. Eh? Because marami na talaga kami ginagawa. So, in the next few days, we will continue to keep you informed about what's going on. And I think I, can, I, think I, will, I, think, uh, I am already uh, authorized by uh, to announce the first uh, nominee that uh, we will be giving to the Commission on Appointments when the time comes, should, should I be proclaimed. 
and that is that our incoming vice president has agreed to take the brief of Department of Education. So si Inday Sara, uh, sabi niya kaya niya, tinanong ko sa kanya kung kaya niya yung, kaya niya yung trabaho dahil mahirap ang trabaho ng, uh, ng, ano, ng Secretary of uh, Education. Uh, so, uh, pero nag-agree naman siya at palagay ko kasama na dyan dahil she is a mother and she wants to make sure that her children are are well uh, well trained and well educated and that that that's the best motivation that we can hope for uh, so that is the that is the first uh, 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 announcement that I can make uh, that has come out of this uh, that come out of this process so again uh, it is 30, 31 million I know the counting is not over it is not yet official but I can always say, I'm always guided and I always look to the fact that 31 million of our countrymen voted for unity. 31 million of our countrymen have uh, agreed to unify and help us unify the country. And that's how, that's the prince, those are the basic principles that we continue to follow. So I won't be taking any questions as I have very little more to announce. So thank you very much. Good evening. Thank you.